Hey guys, I've had many people ask about this hat and what I have on and what kind of head scarf or whatever and really it's it's really cute. I like it. It keeps my hair off my neck and my hair has gotten long. So, this is what it is. Actually, a welder's cap. It is like, I think, eight, one, two, three, six. It is six um, triangles sewed together to a point in the middle with a brim on it. And it has here for the elastic, it has this band sewed around it. And you can see better here the band and the two-tone for the brim. Nothing to it. Somebody that sews, you can get the pattern, I think, online. So it's a welder's cap. I just take the brim, turn it in, and put it on. That's it. And it fits your head pretty good. Asked any welder, it keeps their hair out of the way. But I've also been asked about the black strap wrap. They call it a... Um, Let's see, it's called the Daily Tube. And so, this is what it is, right here. It has multi-purposes. You can use it for several things. It is antimicrobial, so it sh should take the smell out. It's multi-function, it has UV protection, it's a synthetic quick dry, and um, let's see, it's got wicking material. It's also breathable. So, this is my. Let's see if I can get it where you can see. This is the black strap scarf, or whatever you want to call it. It's simply a tube. That's it. Comes in many colors, but this is mine. So I'm going to show you some of the different ways that you can wear it, okay? Okay, one of the first ways you can wear it is, and not everybody would need it, but if you need protection around your neck, wintertime, bugs, whatever, and all this, it wicks the moisture away from your neck. So this is the first way for you to wear it. If you need protection from like the a sandstorm, uh, any kind of protection from breathing in something, that's the second way to wear it. You needed something like this. This is the third way. This would probably be well worth it in the winter time for warmth and keeping your hair out of the way. It keeps your neck protected. It keeps your head. And you can still see and breathe. If you needed your nose covered, that would be it. To pull this up and just have your, just have your eyes free. That one's kind of hard to do with glasses on. It's called a skull cap. And I'm not sure how to make it. I'm not sure I'm going to get this one done, guys. But guys like to wear it like covering just their head. They just poke it in and cover it like a cap. That's a skull cap. Most girls simply want a headband. If you out jogging, running, it wicks the material away. The headband works for whatever you want to do. Okay, the other one is a ponytail. I don't have it where I can... I'm not sure. If you just want to make a ponytail and you don't have anything And keeps your hair up out of your face. Just simply making a ponytail.
And the last one is pretty much like I wear it most of the time when I have it on. I wear it like a scarf. And I have my hair hanging down inside. Right now I've got it up, but my hair hangs down. And it holds like a scarf. So, this is the way I like to wear it where you have the scarf look. So that's my black strap um, review. A lot of people wanted to know how it worked because it's so versatile. And for me, it's fine. I like it this way. This is my way to wear it, but you have such a versatile way to use it. Black strap did not pay me for this. It came in the homestead box. And I just thought I would show you the many ways that it can be wore and the type of head scarves that I wear that some people have asked about. That's the way you wear them, different ways to use it. It has the wicked material. Check out Black Strap. And if you're interested in the welder's cap, you can buy them at local hardware stores usually in a variety of colors. I just like the red, white, and blue. I think I paid about $15 for this cap. So, if you can sew, make your own. But the welder's cap, black strap, and welder's cap. My two favorite head scarves. See you later.